The 6.5 Creedmoor is the best rifle caliber for all hunting situations. That's obviously not true. Every hunting situation requires a change up and requires specific equipment. The 6.5 Creedmoor is a very popular caliber rifle and there are other calibers that are similar, 308, 270. Ultimately, Dave's gonna talk a little bit about why these calibers are in such controversial right now, people are talking about it. All right, yeah, we're gonna talk just a little bit about calibers. We'll kind of compare it to a 270 because that's what most people know about. Uh, calibers are very similar, but we're gonna go ahead and get into a couple of them right now. Wide open, outdoor adventures. I'm fired up, man. I'm gonna see David Dury, their new shop right here in San Antonio. I'm gonna get the 65, 6.5 Creedmoor, yeah. And here at Dury's Gun Shop, the new location right here on 410. Good morning, what's, Dave. What's Welcome going to on? the new store. I love Glad it. to see you. Yeah, I haven't uh, been here before. Been about a year here, and we put a lot of work in this place. It's come out really nice, and we're glad to have you. All right, let's check it yeah. out. Morning. Come on in. Nice. This place is amazing. All right, here it is. Ready to go. Man, I've only seen this in the pictures you sent me. 6.5 Creedmoor. Wow, it's got some weight to it. It's got some weight, holds well, uh, extremely accurate. Yep, we've got five full time gunsmiths. We've got six bays in case we ever get another gunsmith to come in. Uh, but we built a really nice gunsmithing shop. We'll take you all around to, to look at that here in a little while. So the neat thing about the 6.5, um, calibers are very, 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 if you don't mind, we're social distance in here a little bit and everybody's back and uh, away from me for six feet, but uh, calibers are really, really similar. Uh, 270s, 308s, uh, 6.5. So we'll talk a little bit about the 6.5 and why we believe 6.5 is a really good caliber for South Texas deer hunting. And like Dave said earlier, uh, not every caliber is the caliber you want for your situation. Uh, if you're going on, a, on an elk hunt, you may want a different caliber than this. But, but for South Texas deer hunting, you've got a really, really efficient cartridge. Efficiency is the number one thing about a 6.5 Creedmoor that we like. Uh, got great bullet weight. You can go from 120s to 140 grain bullets, uh, running at about 2,800 feet a second. Uh, and you can do all of that with a very short, light recoil uh, cartridge. Uh, and that's its biggest advantage, is you have a really, really uh, all-around cartridge. It, uh, for, for any type of South Texas game, uh, hogs, white-tailed deer, uh, just about anything in South Texas, 6.5 uh, Creedmoor is, is plenty for. Uh, the other thing that we really like about it is its accuracy. There's just something about the 6.5 Creed, Creedmoor that we've realized uh, accuracy is easily achieved with the 6.5 Creedmoor. They shoot really, really, really well. Uh, again, compared to a 270, because um, everybody knows about a 270, they shoot a 130 grain bullet running about 3,000 feet a second. This one takes a 140 grain bullet running 2,800 feet a second, uh, but it does it really efficiently. Uh, Actually, a 6.5 Creedmoor at about 800 yards is almost identical in velocity. It's just a really, really great caliber. It's good information, David. I mean, there's a lot you can learn about reloading and about calibers, but I have a 7mm 08. That's my go-to deer rifle, and I have a 300 wind bag. And this 6.5 Creedmoor is a little lighter, a little less recoil, great for shooting paper, and it gives me that range. I'm working on my rifle lineup. I gotta tell you one thing I noticed when David handed me this gun, it's heavy, probably weighs near nine pounds. What does that do? When you've got this gun out the window of a deer blind, any movement you make is minimized because the gun is heavier. So that can improve your hunting, that can improve your accuracy. Knowledge is power. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button to receive more like it in the future.